Yo, superhumans, today I'm gonna show you the only five exercises you need for mass, and I'm gonna show you them in a complete 19 set workout, and I'm gonna give you an intensity technique for all five of these moves so you can get faster gains from each of these crucial exercises you gotta be doing. So it's gonna be a full body 19 set workout that's gonna grow every single muscle in your body. It's gonna help you make all those gains back that you lost in quarantine, and make sure you stick around until the very end for today's giveaway. So smash a like, Tap the bell if you're new here, subscribe, and let's get into exercise number one. So the first exercise is the barbell deadlift, and we're gonna utilize an intensity technique called Hulk sets. Now let's say I would typically lift three sets of five for 375 pounds. So the total tonnage that I'm lifting there, I think is like 5,600 pounds. 375 times 15 reps. Hulk sets, we're gonna drop the weight by about 20 to 30%, and you're gonna go six sets of six, with only 60 second rest time. So I go 335 pounds for 36 repetitions. I'm lifting more than 10,000 total pounds in a very short amount of time. That's gonna result in extra hypertrophy. It's gonna add a lot of intensity to the exercise. It's gonna result in more muscle gains, utilizing less weight, so it's gonna be a lot easier on your joints. Now you guys got a deadlift, I recommend two times per week. It's gonna hit your hamstrings, your quads, your glutes, your rectors, your back, your lats, your traps, indirectly gonna hit your biceps as well as your shoulders. One of the best all around mass building exercise. Utilizing Hulk sets allows you to lift more weight in less time, resulting in more hypertrophy from this exercise. The second exercise that I chose is the dumbbell one arm row. Now we're gonna go two sets of 10 reps each side and then we're gonna do a finisher where we're gonna go 45 seconds time under tension on each side. Now, the reason that I chose this over the barbell row is first of all, when we do the deadlift, you're doing the Hulk sets, you're hitting most of your back, but the advantage that the one arm row has over say the rowing exercise is when executed properly and really pulling across your body, you're gonna blast your lats, you're gonna blast your terrace major, you're gonna hit your biceps, and you're also gonna hit your rear deltoids because it's really tough to hit your rear deltoids on most of these compound lifts. This is a phenomenal exercise to develop your rear deltoids as well. Now on your form, you've got to be pulling across your body and keeping your elbow in nice and tight. So you wanna go heavy for two sets, 10 reps each side, really controlling the eccentric portion and pulling across. This motion right here of pulling across is what's gonna really hit your lats as well as your terrace major and those rear deltoids. Now the intensity technique, set a stopwatch, go for 45 seconds time under tension on each side. This is gonna add that extra metabolic stress that you need for maximum hypertrophy. Next up we got the barbell squat and you guys are going to love this intensity technique. We're gonna do something that I'm gonna call a devil set for the last finishing set. But first of all, I didn't go super heavy on the workout I'm showing you. I pulled my hamstring about four days ago running sprints. So just did 225 on my working sets, but this is about you guys. On your working sets, I wanna make sure that you guys are not resting at the top of the squat. Keep that quad under constant tension, go a little bit deeper than 90 degrees, right around the eight to 10 rep range until failure. So. First two sets, nice and heavy, working sets, keep that quad under tension. Now the third set, this is killer. You guys are probably gonna have to drop the weight about 50% because what you're gonna do is you are going to squat and you're gonna hold a deep position for three total seconds. Then you're gonna bounce up and you're gonna go six half reps, but you're not gonna come up all the way. This is gonna put extra tension and overload right on those quads. So you're gonna pause for three seconds you're gonna rep out six reps, keeping those quads under tension. You're gonna pause for three more seconds. You're gonna rep out six more reps. You're gonna pause for three more seconds. You're gonna rep out six more sets. I call them devil sets because you're going six, six, six with a three second pause in between. This one will result in so much more hypertrophy than how you guys are normally squatting because I know you guys are ego lifting on the squat. When I go to the gym, like I'm not in a public gym right now, I'm at like a personal trainer gym, but when I was going to Gold's gym before it closed down, I would pay attention to people squatting and I would hardly see anyone actually squat past 90 degrees. So forcing yourself to go more than 90 degrees, adding more time under tension, more overload on this exercise is going to result in some crazy gains. And of course you already know the squat is gonna work the glutes, but it's a major quad builder. It's gonna hit the hamstrings a little bit as well as your erectors and a little bit your traps. Fourth exercise, we're hitting the barbell incline bench press to target that upper chest. It's gonna hit mid chest, 
It's going to hit anterior deltoid, lateral deltoid with a regular grip. It's also gonna hit the triceps a little bit as well. So it's a great mass builder and I know most of you guys are lagging with your upper chest. So I would choose this in a full body workout over a flat bench press any day of the week. Now to add more intensity to this, we're gonna go two heavy working sets in the six to eight rep range. On the very last working set, what I want you to do is drop the weight by about 40 to 50% after you rep out those eight reps until failure, and you're gonna go a drop set. So you're gonna go immediately, rep out as many as you can with no rest in between. So I went, for example, from 225 to 135 with no rest in between. So I did like 225 for six reps, and then no rest in between, strip the weight, immediately go to 135, rep out 10, 12 reps, as many as you can do. And yes, I lost a lot of strength on the incline bench press, but hopefully doing this routine a couple times per week, I will get it back very fast. Exercise number five is gonna be the barbell overhead press. This is gonna work the anterior deltoids, the lateral deltoids, a little bit of upper chest, a little bit of traps, and of course, using your back and your core to stabilize throughout the movement. So form is everything on this. Make sure you're pressing straight up and you're controlling the eccentric portion on this move. Two total sets to start off, eight to 10 rep range, really focus on going heavy, but controlling the weight, slowing down the eccentric portion. Now on the third set, I want you guys to do a super set. So you're gonna do your normal working set, eight to 10 rep range, and then immediately after, you're gonna grab a pair of dumbbells and you're gonna go dumbbell alternate overhead press. One at a time, focusing on controlling the weight on the eccentric, and you're gonna blast out as many reps as you can. So pick a weight on the super set that you can handle for anywhere between 10 to 15 reps. You guys are gonna get a phenomenal shoulder pump from this finisher. So for today's giveaway, we got superhuman burn in our brand new flavor, Smurf Juice. Good old blue gummy bear flavor. This is hands down my favorite pre-workout, best tasting pre-workout, and it's great for fat loss and for muscle pumps. And I'm gonna get into the hands of one of you guys for free. All you have to do is comment down below if your gym is back open or not and where you live. So here I am in Southern California and I live in LA and all the gyms in LA are still closed. So I actually come down here to Chino Hills and train. So it's about a 55 minute drive, but it's worth it just so I can get a great workout and film the content for you guys. So comment down below if your gym is back open and where you live. And I'm gonna pick one person that comments in the first 24 hours of uploading to win a bottle of Superhuman Burn. So thanks for watching guys. Give this video a big thumbs up, share it with anyone trying to make gains, and I will see you guys on the next video.